Good day everyone, this is Jerome Hipoto and for today, let me discuss the social issue regarding the gender inequality among the LGBTQIA plus community. The LGBTQIA plus acronym stands for lesbian, gay, bisexual, transgender, queer, intersex, asexual or ally, and now has been added to represent two spirited which is used by indigenous people to describe their sexuality and gender. And the plus sign encompasses inclusivity. Genesis chapter 1 verse 27 So God created man in his own image and likeness. Man and women he create them. And this is the reason why many people and other religious organizations serve this as a basis of our sexuality. But many people get confused regarding the difference of sexuality and gender roles in our society. Sex and gender are not the same. In general term, sex refers a person's physical characteristics at birth, while the gender encompasses a person's identities, expressions, and societal roles. This confusion and mindset of every individual in our society led to a social issue called gender inequality. As we move forward, let us tackle the causes and the effects of gender inequality that timely and relevant in our society. The first one is the boying the boy and girling the girl. Once the child born, they are molding them based on their sexuality and as the effect, they're not able to choose their gender roles in the society. The second one is the LGBTQIA plus members always face a discrimination. The LGBTQIA plus members always facing a discrimination among their fellow and this is the reason why others cannot be true among themselves. The third one is unequal rights. Among LGBTQIA plus members that can lead to exclusivity in terms of being valid individual in our society. Living in this world that is dynamic and full of judgments, it's so hard to be part of LGBTQIA plus community. There's a lot of hindrance to be true to yourself. But according to John chapter 8 verse 32, only the truth will set you free. Despite of discrimination and judgments that were experienced, we should be true to ourselves on who and what we are upholding our rights above discriminations, the spirit of inclusivity will conquer every people judgments. To my fellow members, we are valid. We don't need the approval of other people to show on who and what we are. To my sister Mitch of Miss q and Intertalactic 2019, Thank you for reminding us that we are valid and we are part of every community. Bakla, bahagi kami ng lahat. Once again, this is Jerome Hipalto and thank you for listening. Bye!